What's up guys and welcome back to another episode of Max Set from AGS. If you did miss the last one, check out the description, you can go check it out. Anyway, we built up our cash stack quite a bit and we started PKing with the Staff of Dead and Blessed Spirit Shield. Uh, we have 9.2 mil to our name. I'm going to go get a couple kills really quickly, try and get that cash stack to 10 mil, and then we'll start getting some upgrades. If you guys do enjoy this video, hit that like button, subscribe if you are new, and I will see you guys later. Thank you so much for watching. So I found this guy up at uh, 44s who was unsculled, but he was in some pretty decent gear. I was unsculled at the time too, so I thought he was just going to log out. So I just attacked him. He had a blessed spirit shield, he had a 10, and he had uh, Torai's plate legs and D shoes. So if he sculled, he's probably risking like upwards of 3 mil, I'd say so. So it would have been a really nice kill, but I just didn't want to let him get away. You see, I pop off an early spec there. Does get his prayer on, so pretty, you know, unfortunate. He looked like a really big noob. He had like dragon gloves and everything. So maybe it was a bait. That's what I thought. Turns out it wasn't. You see here is, I think he's, when it, he's out of food. He actually got me down quite a few brews. Like what? He got me down four brews. I have like six brews in here. Is when he was out. I catch that last freeze and he's like no restores or something. So we do take him out the game with the 30 barrage. And we still get 300k in the looting bag. Even though he's unsculled, so not bad loot at all, you know, I'll definitely take it. Then we found this level 102 salad robes warrior, who PJ'd me earlier when I almost got, like, I almost smited some guy for an AGS. So I was very salty about that. Had to take the salad robes warrior out of the game. He had dragon gloves as well, but seems to be some sort of, like, I don't know, disease going around. Either way, good fight. Yes, I love it when they play the hero. That is just what I want. Now I can chuck up my smite. Nah, no, I don't want to AGS him through prayer, I don't think. I just want to catch a freeze. Oh, I'm misclicking everything. I still caught it, that's nice. Put a ball in. Hopefully this guy doesn't come PJ me, though. That's what I don't want. Bro, but light, light Ballista hits hard. What is this? Chuck up the smite? Dead? 45? I was just going for a ball, I guess. But that Light Ballista tears me to shreds. Change your prayers again? Oh my god, he did as well, and I hit a 41, dude. Where was my 70? Take off the home going for freeze? I don't trust these white dots logging in, dude. I'm going to pray melee. Catch a freeze, please? You just called me a noob. What? Why am I a noob? I didn't do anything newbie. I'm not a noob. Come on. Why is Ditter, why are they asking me to off like I'm gonna off? Like wh what do they ha hold over me? That's gonna make me off a potentially free light ballista if I do smite this guy. I'm not getting PJ'd right now, which is nice. 21, let's go for the ball. Oh, I took off my glory. I'm legit stupid at the game. Catch a freeze, nice. Go for a hit. I'm just gonna fall in on him, man, so they can't see when I'm attacking. Okay, wait. I just got bolted off AGS, I made AGS him. Oh, oh, that guy almost one hit him. I CBA, dude, he almost one hit him. YouTube. Yes, YouTube. They have a very interesting way of speaking, I'll give them that. Come on, what KO? Dude, they even have a cannon set up here. Jesus Christ. Put a bolt in. Come on, what KO, please? 17. 18. Bolts, please. Oh, that's a D fire. That could kill him. What KO, please. Dead? Good fight. No smite, though. That's unfortunate. 270k. We found that amenity imposter again. Well, the nice one, at least. Level 109. Uh, we last killed him. We were in max gear with, like, gear and everything. This time, uh, we know we didn't have the toxic stuff of dead. We didn't have all our max stuff. So it was a little bit more of an even fight. And uh, we started fighting for a little bit. So here you see, I, I balled him a little bit. He pulls out his claws, so I tried to anti him by AGS specking him, but he didn't actually change his prayers. If he did, I probably would have killed him, but it's fine. You know, we're going for another ball, a nice 40, I think it was. He pulls out his robes, bolts him again, bolts him at 26. I'm just going to AGS him through the prayer. He changes his prayers regardless. I risked it a little bit there, got him down to 35 HP, and got the kill, and we got around 555k in our looting bags. So they're definitely making some very decent money. All right, like two or three kills I think we got. Let's sell it all, see where our cash deck is at. All right, so almost 11 mil in cash. We currently have this toxic stuff and basically everything else is lacking. Now, I honestly don't even want to get tank legs yet. I don't want to get Torex plate legs. The thing I want to go for, and you might call me crazy, is the dragon crossbow. I just want to know if I can afford it. Nine, 900k. Let me see. Yes, okay, and I'm going to get myself some bolts for that as well. And we're going to go PK in Mystic's Black Dehyde and the Staff of Dead dragon crossbow. I don't even want to get the toxic staff yet. I just want the damage output, honestly. 
We are also now risking 28 mil already, so quite a big risk for, you know, some pretty standard gear in terms of, like, our defensive bonuses. Alright, we got a fight versus this guy. Neither of us were sculled, but he said he'll just skull up. Honestly, I think if I died to one of these guys, you know, who had the courtesy to just skull up first, I'd probably give them the loot if I did die. Although you guys would probably get pissed at that, because it means I have to restart again. Either way, good luck to him. Someone just logged in. Oh, it's Vic Vaughn. Oh, he just pulled out the AGS. You need to relax. Damn, I'm taking a lot of damage right now. He's got the room plate legs. Not the best. Let's drink some brews. There we go. Let's catch a freeze there. I might go in for a cheeky little spec. On his robes, dead. 57 for the KO. Good fight. I know this guy's going to PJ me. PJ me last time. I got a kill, but it's whatever. We'll figure it out. This guy just said, don't put him in his vid. His boss is going to fire him. Well, mate... I think you're going to be looking for a good job. Good fight, man. 580k loot. No TY? Uh, I wasn't really asking, my guy. And I just hit you a 31 whip, so you better you better start eating, my friend. I'm barraging him in my chaps. I don't know what... Something's gone horribly wrong. Put in a whip? I think I might be able to smite this guy. Holy shit, a 42 whip. He's going to pray melee there. I'm going to hit a 0, but I'm just going to pop off the spec. That's a nice one. He's going to pray melee, probably. Yes, but I hit a 0 bolt. Take off the helm to catch the freeze. That should be an instant freeze. Putting in a lot of damage on this guy already. He smited there, or he double-clicked his prayers? Probably double-clicked his prayers. Praying melee, put a bolt. The bolts are not doing us justice right now, man. Whip. Okay, let's go for another bolt then. 73x speed drop, smork. Whip him. Oh my god, okay, I think I'm gonna have to refreeze him soon. Uh, I should catch this instant if I do catch it. Nice. He hasn't hit me back at all, which means, oh, as I say, I jinxed myself. So it's DD under him, another zero. Did you just get smited there, or he double clicked his prayers? He double clicked his prayers. It's a nice XB drop. Oh, he's pulled out the solid robes. He is, in fact, the solid robes warrior. I'm just gonna try and pop this back off. I hit a 10. Could have been better. I also could have been worse. I could have hit, like, nine lower numbers. Can I zoom battle here. I tried luring him a little bit away from the entrance. I might be able to do it here. Freeze him outside, nice. Chuck up the smite. Come on, give me a big bolt. There we go. Into the spec, potentially smited, dead. 56 for the KO. We managed to take him outside the gate. No AGS smite, unfortunately. How many restores? He had four doses of restore left. Probably one of them got smited, to be honest. A lot of white dots coming in. Let's pick off the zoom and get out of here. 118 bolts as well. Not bad. I got a fight with Elboy. Good luck to him. See, in Black D had Mystics, people still find fight you. As soon as you pull out the Barrows gear, they won't fight you. It doesn't matter on what like weapons you're using. Like Toxic Stuff, Dragon Crossbow, they'll still fight you as long as your gear is sort of like... You know, down geared a bit. Sometimes the Serp Helm will scare. This guy's actually out DPSing me like so much right now. A little bit awkward. Catch a freeze? Still can't freeze him. Fuck it. I'm just gonna try and get some damage in before I have to brew. I'm already down quite a lot of food. Have to use my combo food. Catch a freeze? Another splash. Jesus Christ. What the hell? This guy's up here to go do KBD or something. Catch another freeze? There we go. Nice. Let's put a bolt in. Oh, he's just gonna camp crit range. Let's whip him, I think. Oh, that's a nice 28. Who's just logging in? Oh, we're fine. Catch a freeze, prim mage. Put a bolt in there. Nice prim melee. I think I might be able to set up a spec here. Dead? Dead? Another zero. Oh my, that's unlucky. That is unlucky, unfortunately. He did not get his prayers on in time, for sure, but... Specs just didn't pull through. Let's fake you another melee hit here. I just drank a brew right after that. That was mad awkward. I'm about to drink my range pot. Catch a freeze. Please. There we go. That's a big XP drop. Prey mage right there. Going for a big bolt. If he doesn't freeze me, I thought he was going to change his prey. Oh, he did as well. I should have gone in for a spec. Oh, he's too high HP now. Just whipped him with a spirit shield on and no shoes. Probably not the smartest decision, huh? Get a nice bolt off. Zero. Whip. Down. Prey melee there. Saw that spec coming. Into the G Mall. Is he going to change his prayers here? Dead? Oh, if he changes prayers, you could have died. He double clicked them as well. And I hit a zero. 41. Off dub chick. What? Bolt kill, please? Oh, I hit a zero. You could have just died to a bolt right there, dude. That's depressing. That is depressing. 21. He's probably gonna start running after this, I think. That's a big XP drop into the whip. He's gotta get he's gotta be getting smited here, right? Like genuinely getting smited here. Come on. I'm doing so much damage right now. Big barrages. Let's pull out the AGS in just a second. Make him camp prey melee. He's going down. Unless this guy PJs me, of course. Oh, of course I splashed the most important freeze. Okay, we got one more. Nice. He's going with the whip. 
Uh, not the zero. Come on, Bolt. I believe in you. That's a nice XP drop. It's fakey the melee. Going for another Bolt. Going for a freeze here. He's brewed down. I think he's out of food here. He probably will die, hopefully. 23. Mega for a last ditch attempt. Come on, freeze him. No way. Please, please, please catch. I think he's dead there. Good fight. Just got him at the end. He almost got out. I would have been very angry. Yeah, I've killed him in this exact same spot before as well. He almost did made it, but we did get the loot. Good fight. Successfully out with... Sphere 570k in the looting bag. Got a fight with this guy, Akia. Oh, shit. I haven't even frozen the dude. Legit. I might want to do that first, huh? Before we, you know, we get into the statistical side of the battle. Oh, he just defired me right off the bat. Hit me at 27 through the prayer. Relax. Damn, he's working me. He needs to calm it down. Let's play range there. Put on the shoes for some extra defense bonus. Is he going in for the AGS right away? Nah, I think he's faking it there or something. I don't really know, to be honest. Prey mage, nice. Take off the shoes again, going for a freeze. Should get him off prey there, nice. Uh, he's still praying mage for some reason. Okay, going for a freeze. Off prayer again, splash. I think I can get this kill, to be honest. I've fought this guy a couple times before. It should, I mean, I should win. But obviously I'm not here for the win, you know. I want to get the kill. Prey mage right there. Nice. Going for a freeze. I could have gone him for a spec there if I'm not, I'm pretty sure I'm frozen right now, though. I'm gonna just super combat up anyway. Going for it? Oh, I'm frozen. Mad awkward, huh? I think he might spec me in a second. I'm pretty low. I'm 72 right now. I'm just gonna go in for it. Into the G-Mole. Dead? Dead? 65-23 for the KO. Good fight, man. Pretty decent loot, I hope so. Uh, no Sears ring or anything. But still enchanted. And I have my uh, looting bag so I can pick up basically everything. Good fight, man. Fought that guy a couple times before. I've never actually killed him, though. So, I guess that's good. And the rune stack is piling up as well. Right, all the loot in the bag, 618k, not bad at all. So just a little bit of context for this next clip. Skill Specs was streaming some uh, tribute PKing in PvP worlds, and they're actually like Mystic Tribriders. Usually you never find Mystic Tribriders in uh, PvP worlds. It's all RMs, max stuff. So I was like, okay, you know what, I can go for some nice 1v1s here because I probably won't get PJ'd. I was also going to bring my Mage Cape with me just in case I got someone like low or out of food. I could Mage Cape TB them and probably kill them. Then I find this guy who was uh, who was risking a dragon crossbow against me. Now, I was risking my dragon crossbow as well, as well as my staff and my serpentine helm, obviously. But he was still risking like 13 mil, I think, because he risked the whip as well. And originally, I was trying to mage cape him, but I just couldn't find a good time to do it. So I decided to bank it and just try and fight him more times than once and potentially go for the kill. Because I only have one opportunity at TBing him, but if we keep fighting, I get like more chances to kill him. Okay, another fight with a Niki. He's risking a dragon crossbow and uh, a normal whip. So I'm risking like 8 mil more than him, but he's definitely risking a lot more than the other fights. We fought like four times, GL, and um, I was going to mage cape him originally and try to like uh, TB kill him, but I feel like it would just be easier if I just uh, got more sessions with him and just try to go off for a kill. He said he wasn't a fan of the one HP meta, uh, 100 HP meta, so I said I'll sit lower, I guess, even though he can basically one-shot me from this HP right now. So I definitely got to be careful. And uh, if I sit lower, I hope that means he will sit lower too. So, you know, we could potentially go in for a kill. Let's catch a freeze there, please. We really need to catch this freeze or we could die. Bad things could happen. Because I'm going to try and sit lower for him. Just so, you know, it's a little bit easier to get a spec off. If he doesn't pray melee here, he's literally dead. Into the G Mall, please. Dead? 2950. Good fight. I think we just peek at the Dragon Crossbow. Dragon Crossbow. That is a very good kill. 42 ball into the 50 29 gmol. I mean 50 ags 29 gmol. No surviving it. Dragon dragon stone bolts. 10 of those are not that many. I'll show some clips of the fights we were doing earlier when I did have the mage cape in me. But it was definitely a smart call not throwing the TB because now I got more of a legit kill. And, you know, confirmed 12 mil loot. Good fight, man. Very respectable as well. He said good fight, mate, as he dried. No looting bag, obviously, so let's just go price check this real quick. Normal whip is 2.4 mil, dragon crossbow is 12 mil. I mean, uh, it's 9 point something mil. 12.7 mil PK. Can definitely go get a couple upgrades with that. So Skill Specs actually wanted to fight me, and uh, he was doing some low HP DDS tribrating with a dragon crossbow as the plus one. So we were still risking the tent, but we were using a much worse spec weapon, which means we had to sit low HP. And I think I'll just let you guys watch his point of view for this one. And then he gets the instant freeze, even on my hides? It just, it says the fight. Oh, 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 no, 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 no. Did I really just do that? Oh my god, I turned my prayers off like an idiot. I quick, quick prayer. 
I'm so rusty, bro. I can't even hit him here. What is this shit? Oh! Good fight? Uh, yeah, I guess. I think I can get this pull a clip off his stream. So, 1.75 mil loot. I wasn't really using my AGS, but I was using my Dragon Crossbow. He only does DDS fights. Good fight to him. He also said I'm going to get rag listed, so if there's no videos for a couple days, you know why. I'm... Right, so the cash deck is looking quite low, but I think we can liven it up a little bit with all we've PK'd today. So, let's just sell it all and see how much money we get. Rightio, so a 15.5 mil cash stack. The first thing I'm gonna do is make it official. I'm gonna make this uh, normal staff of the dead into a toxic one, which means we purchased the magic fang for about a little bit over four mil. I have to take a, oh shit, I need a chisel. I know, I know how to do this chisel like that. And we now have a toxic staff. Obviously, we'll get some scales for that. We have 11 mil. We might get them in a cult. What upgrades do you guys want me to get? We'll get them at the start of next episode. If you guys do enjoy this video, or you did enjoy this video, hit that like button, subscribe if you are new, and I'll see you guys later. Hopefully you did enjoy.